What's up everybody? Well, I got another AZ Satellite gameplay video for you guys today. And today, we're gonna check out Lies of P. Now, I'm hoping that it'll run halfway decently, but one, one way to find out. Now, I'm gonna try to hook it up to the Gavish computer. Probably isn't gonna work, so probably gonna have to do this all camera as usual on this thing, which sucks. But it is what it is. At least my camera is awesome, and that's us get a good uh, good view, but I still like doing the cam uh, screen recorded too. So hopefully eventually one day that starts working. That would be great. Anyway, we're just gonna do what I've been doing in the past couple videos. We're just gonna, I'm just gonna hop in, figure out what settings work, and then call them my settings for 1080p. Then we'll hop in and do 720, and I'm gonna kinda treat it almost like a console performance and quality mode. I figure people while playing at 1080p probably care more about graphics and whatnot than frame rate. So I'll try to get like a 30, 40 FPS experience on that. And then on 720p, we'll put things more on low and medium and whatnot, cause we're probably looking for more of a FPS experience there. If you're willing to drop it from its native resolution and all that, you're definitely looking more for FPS than you are for quality. So that is why I'm going to do it that way. And of course, if anybody does not like me doing it this way and wants me to go back to testing all of the settings, I can for sure do that. There was just a bunch of people saying it was a waste of time. So I was like, eh, they're not wrong. Waste of time for them, waste of time for me. So figure, screw it. Let's just do it this way for a little and see if people like it. And if they don't, they'll let me know. But anyway, let's not waste any more time. Let's go, uh, well, let me download the game and then I'll hop in, figure out settings work, and then we'll hop in and get some gameplay. So, here are the settings I've decided to go with. We're doing 1080p, unlimited frame, V-Sync off, no FSR. We got that FX stuff on though. Detail settings. Now, we went with a mixture of medium and high settings because I was going for a 30 to 40 FPS experience here. At least at 1080p, I figure people care more about graphics on 1080p mode than they do about FPS, so that's why I'm doing it this way. And then for 720p, I'll focus more on FPS. So, now that we got that out of the way, let's go hop on into the game and we'll see how she plays. All right, let's get ourselves a little gameplay here at 1080p and then we'll drop it down to 720p. Get over here, you. You want some too? Anybody else? I thought there was one more around here. Yeah, so far this game runs pretty dang good, even though it's not getting like, you know, 60 FPS ish like the Steam Deck can do. But the Steam Deck is only playing at 720p, you mind it. I'm surprised it can do so well even at 1080p, and this is only at 25 watts. I just do the normal turbo, I didn't mess with anything. Alright, now we can fight these guys. I'm probably gonna get my ass kicked by that weird knight guy. So, unfortunately, I keep getting owned. But I almost beat him last time because I staggered him or something like that. Can't go through that door at all, and I'm willing to bet you can't go through here either. The station employee has the train station. Yep, I have to beat that one guy, I bet you. And then I'll probably get those keys. Nope, no more of that, man. I could do that to that one dude I'm trying to fight. That would make the fight a lot easier. Get him like half health right off the bat.
twice before doing it. Nope. Oh. not good. I had to waste one of those things already. I'm gonna need, I needed like all of them against this guy down here. Shit. Well, I can almost assure I'm going to lose, but whatever. Get in there. I thought he was after one. Oh well. Man, this guy's almost like a boss to me, and he's just a regular creature. How in the heck am I ever gonna beat this dude? Well, in any case, this seems like a perfect time to go drop things down to 720p and try to beat him again. So here are the settings I've decided to go with for 720p. Still no FSR. Go into the graphics details here. Mostly medium and low this time, because I'm going for a 60 plus experience now. So I figure that's what people want if they're gonna be willing to drop things down to 720p and all that. And then we're back to the top, so there we go. So now, let's go hop back into the game and see how she runs and watch me get my ass kicked some more. So, here we go, 720p now, trying to stay above 60. The game honestly still doesn't even look that bad, to be honest with you. At least in my opinion. Fucking target the wrong one, you dumb dumb. everybody that was down here. Just take another quick look around to make sure if I move correctly I can't get through that door. So yeah, I think we're on our way up this way. Oh yeah, I can't go that way. I gotta go get the keys from the guy I can't beat. <laughs> At least I assume. That might not even be where I get the keys. That might just be some dude.
think I got hit at all this time. So that means I have all three. Now, if I would have had one more heal last time, I probably would have won. So hopefully I can win this time. I'm hoping. But only time will tell. Maybe it was for the doors down there, too. Didn't really think about that. Should have probably tried to open the doors that were right in front of me. Out of my way, dead carcass. But I don't think we ever dropped under 60. like the things that you uh like save at or whatever. This is called a stargazer. A marvelous device the stalkers used in the past. Anyway, though, this stargazer will make you strong. why don't we go ahead and go wrap this video this on up? Well, all right, guys, that's a wrap for Lies of P on the Asus ROG Ally, and it did a pretty good job. We got around 30, 40 FPS at 1080p, though it probably would have dropped into like the high 20s and low 30s once we got outside, because that's what happened to my 720p. We we're getting like 70, 80, 90 to 100 FPS. Then we step outside and we're down into the low 60s already. So even my low settings will barely get 60 FPS, but that's what I was kind of expecting. And that's why I went more conservative. And I was also like, damn, I really hope I can beat this guy and get out of here. Otherwise people are gonna yell at me and be like, you didn't even go outside, you idiot, or something like that. So I might have to redo the Steam Deck video just to see how it does. But in any case, that is all I got for you guys for this particular video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me get my ass handed to me and enjoyed watching the video because I sure as hell enjoyed making it for you guys. And until the next video, Peace out, guys.